Good day folks, welcome to 406 region. Just uh, moving the cows and the rams here. Come on Chip! Come on cows! You lazy duffers. This here's all last year's uh, ram crop. These majority of these will either be uh, up for sale or get put in the freezer here toward end of the green season. So. Come on cows. Come on! Guess they weren't too bad on feed because they're not very anxious to move. It's funny, all the uh, the big rams think that bull was protection, so they all stick with him. Always got a few lazy ones around. Gotta be the last ones to the gate. Come on! Holding up the daily progress. Alrighty, folks. So, there we are. Cows are on their green grass, which they've been getting moved daily, just like the sheep. So, this is what they're leaving behind. Um, this ground here was grazed late last fall uh, this over here was not but as you can see I got I'm trying to get him across this well house coulee here and as you can kind of tell the line is right here to that fence so this is a really good improved field and then where they grazed last fall so what we're doing trying to get as much of this punched down out here as we can but yet still leave a good amount of residual as you can tell you know like this blade here this one wasn't even touched um, other than being laid flat so there's definitely some young alfalfa in here that's gonna be coming up <clears throat> quite a bit of it really in the uh, in the spots so we're gonna see what it does because they've been getting daily moves here with no hay we stop feeding hay until the snow flies again and I'm gonna use this gonna use this area as my experimental spot I'm gonna see if I can't get some animals across this however like three four times this year in the, in this one area from most places they only it's a one and done kind of thing uh, but after listening to Greg Judy's talk and stuff like that I might I'm gonna try try different things and try to adapt to different ways so Right now, they're getting all this candy, and we'll come back to this field, and well, since it's spring, we'll try. We'll look back at this field in 30 days, and uh, we'd look back, and we'd start on that end. So we'd have to go see on that end if the grass is recovered or not, and if it is, at that point in time, uh, it might just be the rams again or the ewes but from a month from now most of the animals are going to be way out back so it'll depend on what what we get up here to run through them like I said I'm going to try to run through it as much as I can but uh, until then and for this evening you all have a good night